Okay, I have some explaining to do here. Old laptop connected to an external power supply. I have 110 volts into an adapter providing 12 volts to this five and a quarter inch floppy drive. That floppy cable is then connected to an external USB three and a half inch. Now what's going on here? Well, the drive is working on something. And if you can see that, it's booting into Windows 98 DOS. That is awesome. Apparently this drive, this using this method, is not accessible under Windows XP. So my next challenge is to see if I can get that going. If I can figure that out, amazing. So this drive is connected to this external USB drive designed for a three and a half inch. But this chip, I think, is the secret. This contains, if I'm not mistaken, a USB controller, and I think that's an EEPROM, including a floppy drive controller. And so those same signals are shared over the floppy cable by both three and a half and five and a quarter inch drives. And it's just similar enough that they seem to work.